Um, today we're going to talk about background noise and um, here this is how to remove background noise um, background noise from your track so you, as you can hear I've got quite a bit of background noise right so we could use a gate to eliminate the background noise when we're not talking so if we turn the gate on right as you can hear it cuts the sound off when I don't talk depending on the threshold and the return that you set so you can put your threshold and it will just keep it will keep cutting you off but if you just have your threshold right and you return you release set your release to more so you if you're talking in between so <clears throat> that's one way of getting rid of background noise um, as you can see it removes some background noise but it can cut your voice off um, that's basically one way um, it's not very efficient right? but um, it can do the job if you're trying to do something uh, but there's another way with a plugin called X noise from waves so if you get this plugin you see from waves and we start it up we're going to learn the noise so let's click the learn button okay so that's learnt the shape of the noise and now if we turn the threshold up right now if you look you can actually hear that the, the noise is almost gone you see so this is actually the best way of um, getting rid of your background noise is with a plug-in so but you do get um, a bit of um, latency look so if you look here it says your latency is 106.7 milliseconds so if you if you're removing the background noise on a track that you've uh, done your vocals on and uh, you're re-recording it to another track to remove the noise you'll have to uh, nudge your, your vocals forward once you've recorded it because this latency but you know this is, does a good job I've used it in the past and it's uh, does a really good job so that's it guys for today so see you later